back to my channel. Today is a bitch's birthday. I am 22 years old. I just wanna say I am sorry for not being more active on YouTube. Your girl is back doing better. So that was kind of a fail in a way. Um, but today is my birthday. This is my little outfit or whatever. Looking cute as fuck, you already know. Um, but I just wanted to come back on here and give you guys a little life update on how life is going. Um, so life's going pretty good, you know. Estrogen is making your girl happier than ever. I am very happy um, with my transition and my life in general. Just, I'm very proud of myself on how far I came in life and how I, just it's it's hard being a trans woman out here and to just face those things and do what you want to do regardless of what anybody thinks about you is very inspiring but i just kind of wanted to come on here and address the the fact that i haven't been on youtube and just kind of give you guys the reason why um let's put this back up here and give it a try y'all all right so basically um i was on Selexa for two years. I think I've probably, I've had to have mentioned this in another video before, but I was on Selexa for two years. And Selexa is a, it's a depression medicine. It's like a, um, an inhibitor, a serotonin inhibitor. It raises your serotonin levels to try to make you a happier person and just increase your quality of life. And I think that, I'm about to stand right here. And I think that, you know, um, that it helped for a really long time uh but then as i as it went further and further me on the medication i was on the highest dose the selexa started to run out you know i do have depression and anxiety i do struggle with those um i'm not scared to say that uh you know it doesn't it doesn't define me i do have days where i don't want to like get get out of bed or you know do anything or you know i lose my confidence for a little bit but you know, I always bounce back. I'm never gonna be stuck in one spot. Um, so I knew that it was time for me to switch medications. So I had went from Selexa to, um, what was it that I went to? Zoloft. I went to Zoloft, which I'm just talking from my personal experience. You know, Zoloft may work for some people, but for me, I started taking it and basically I just started to get really depressed and I was just really, really down. And, you know, I don't know. Um, I just think that it wasn't helping me. It was, it was making me very worse. Um, I would just not want to get out of bed. I wouldn't want to like do my makeup or anything or just, just not do the things that I normally felt like doing or I just wasn't, I could tell that the medication was not helping me. So, uh, which I don't really wear makeup that often. I'm just saying that I didn't even feel like really putting myself together, basically, not even just with makeup. Just, I, I didn't feel like putting myself together, really. Um, I think that it, it really messed with me in a whole. And so basically I was on it for a whole month. It just progressively made me worse. And I think now it's been like a month since I've been, I switched to Prozac. And Prozac is really helping me. Um, I think that it's increasing my my moods. Like I'm in a better mood. Uh, I'm happy. Like you know, I, I feel great. And I think that I may have found my my depression medication that is right for me. And I'm I'm happy about it. You know, I mean that could change in the future. You never know. But as of right now, no. Uh, I think that as of right now, it's just fine. Like I think that the Prozac is really helping me. I think that it's in improving my quality of life in general um i i'm very thankful for everyone who stayed subscribed you know i haven't i haven't really been active in the past two months i think i made a video recently like a month ago i can't really remember the last time i made a video but it's been a very long time but that is the reason why because i just wasn't feeling like myself i was just kind of in like a creative block like i didn't really know what to create or what to talk about and i think that um it it would be great for you guys to tell me what you guys have in, have in mind on what you want to see next. Uh, I do want to keep this rolling. I do want to keep growing. You know, YouTube isn't something that just grows overnight. Uh, I didn't just get 712, uh, 712 subscribers was the most I've had. 
Um, I think I'm at like 709 now because of the inactivity, I understand. Um, but here we are, we're here, uh, I'm human, you know, things do come up. So, but I'm back, I'm here, um, I'm ready for 2022. I really want to hit it full steam. I want to make vlogs. I want to um, just show you guys my personality more and just be happy and just vlog with you guys. And as I said, like, just show my journey because I am really happy with who, with the, with the woman I am today. I am extremely happy. Like, I could not be any more happier than where I'm at today. Like, seriously. Um, I'm thankful and I really love you guys. I love all of you that have just stayed on here this whole entire time and just stayed subscribed because I did get my community posts unlocked so I can actually make statuses and upload pictures and I can talk to you guys on there now. And I think that that's a, that's a great accomplishment for me. I'm at around like 72,000 views. Self made me like I did that by myself. I don't, I don't depend on anybody else. I do it all on my own. So I think that just doing these videos by myself and that's a lot. And I, I just want to say thank you guys. And I can only hope that we'll be big someday as this channel will be big. So, but I love you guys so much. It is my birthday. I did do some photo shoot pics. They are coming. I know you guys probably like my outfit. Girl, I look good. Ooh, and the hair, girl, you know, I got my money piece and the little rose gold red. Yes, we are here for it. But I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for truly being here for me through this time. And I just wanted to give you guys an update and be honest. You know, it's okay to open up about your, about what's going on mentally with you. It's okay to open up about what you feel, what you're going, what you feel sad about, what you, what's on your chest. You're allowed to talk about that because you're human. So... I'm here and I'm back and I love you guys so much. Let me know what you want to see next. Love you.